Hello students, welcome to one more amazing session from Infinity Land. This is Suresh, Faculty of Chemistry. Today I am going to explain you the impact of the Markovnikov rule in deciding the product in addition reactions of an alkane. So before going for that, I just want to show you what is a score examination. It is India's largest scholarship examination. This scholarship examination, why it is called India's largest scholarship? Because this scholarship examination provides you scholarship worth of 1 crore rupees and also study setup and laptop and many more things like educational allowances and uh, up to 100% scholarship. While it in the description box, the link is available. You just click it and fill the form and uh, try to grab all the facilities that is given by the score exam. And one more important thing exam about this score examination is you are uh, maybe a student of Infinity Learn or you may be a student of any other institute, still you are eligible to write this score examination. And of course, this score examination is completely online. You can sit at home and you can write the exam. And one more important thing here, whenever you are preparing for any examination, it is required for how you are preparing and where you stand exactly. For that, you need a proper assessment. For that, Infinity Learn scientifically designed All India Test Series Pack. And NEET for 2025, NEET 2025 All India Test Series Pack, which includes 27 EITS examination in the 13 unit test, 4 part test and 10 grant test. And also 20 NEET full syllabus mock test and 3 physics chemistry books along with video solutions on the app and detailed solutions and detailed reports for each and every examination will be given and your performance will be benchmarked with Sri Chaitanya students. And these many facilities who is going to give in India only Infinity Learn is giving. So you just click the link in the description box and you enjoy this session package for 2999 when you applied youtube 50 off coupon code it was 5999 50% slash you are going to get automatically you will be getting limited time offer for 2999 while yet link is available in the clay description box and you can click it and you can enjoy it so let's go into what is a markonikov rule so markonikov rule so, when an alkene is added with an HBr or HCl whatsoever, if the alkene is symmetrical, the product that is formed has no difference. You are going to get a halo compound. If the alkene is unsymmetrical, you are going to get two different structural isomers, constitutional isomers. So, they are called regiomers and the reaction is going to proceed in such a way that one of the isomer is going to be the major product. Such type of reactions are called regioselective reactions. So the regioselective reactions, uh, what could be the major product can be explained on the basis of Markovnikov rule. So Markovnikov rule says when alkene is added with a reagent, unsymmetrical alkene is added with a reagent the major product formed is going to be. So, when negative part of the reagent attaches to the carbon of double bond which bears the least number of hydrogens. This is an empirical relation given by Markovnikov. So, let us see it is a long long ago in 1850s or so. So, that much work he has done and let us see exactly what these structures are shown. And this is a propene when HBr is added you are going to get uh, uh, HIE is added or HCl is added, you are going to get a 2 idopropane and uh, this um, alkene is added with HCl, you are going to get this product. So, these two are unsymmetrical. So, most substituted carbon of the double bond is going to be reactive. How it is possible? Let us say an example here. For this propane HBr is added, first protonation is happened. So, one protonation is happened, you are going to get a secondary carbocation, you are going to get a primary carbocation. So, on the stability of carbocation, primary carbocation less stable than secondary carbocation. So, this is probably the product that can be given from this rearing, uh, reactant and reaction intermediate. And uh, secondary carbocation is more stable and it is brominated to give rise alkyl halide like this. So, always remember more stable carbocation is going to give the major product. Let us see based on this uh, how the other things can be given. So, 
cyclo methyl cyclopentene when hcl is added this is the carbon merely we can say it is a carbon with less number of hydrogens or zero number of hydrogens so negative part of the reagent here it is a positive part a negative part you are going to add a chlorine over here so it is the major product sometimes you can see the other way and in this case h plus and br minus you are going to see the bromine is going to be added in the which place the carbon with the less number of hydrogens so the product you are going to get here bromine is formed here and when it is bromine is formed you are going to get ch3 group is in the trans and you can also see ch3 group is going to be the cis so you are going to get the stereoisomers as well and let's see one more important thing this reaction takes place by rearrangement when rearrangement takes place directly you can't use it marconi cup rule marconi cup rule has a limitation wherever rearrangement is there don't use it let's see what exactly happened this is the actual product is happening so how this product is formed let's see first protonation happens when the protonation happens at this double bond you are going to get a carbocation this carbocation is a secondary carbocation when this methyl group is going to be shifted so you can say methyl shift you can say methyl shift you are going to get a tertiary carbocation this tertiary carbocation is more stable as compared to this secondary carbocation and this tertiary carbocation is brominated with br minus to give rise is corresponding product so like that whenever rearrangement is there directly you can't use the marconi cup rule so you can also see anti marconi cup addition when you use a peroxide effect so here peroxide is not there so you have to use marconi cup rule so like that stay tuned for such type of simple topics and twisted topics in this neat examination preparation journey so please like this session and share with your friends and subscribe to infinity learn neat youtube channel and every day i am coming up with a short topic and i am explaining you thank you thank you very much